play our music. All right, guys, I am here today with the semifinals for the Hardcore Cup. I'm Andrew with your own game live at Joel Mouse's Canon Hardcore Battlefield. With him is Mr. Cack. And we are going in round number one. Looks like Dolma Railway, Blue Team RU is going to be Obey, Red Team China, GSD, Genetically Superior Players. And I think that if anybody's going to beat GSP, it would be Obey, uh, based on Obey's uh, performance recently. And let's go ahead and watch. Got Juice Slayer moving in with Dissected Soul. Looks like they're going to jeep on up towards Alpha and Bravo. And we'll go to a top view here. Alpha, Bravo. Or, oh, it looks like they're going to Charlie. And uh, so far it looks like Obey is going to beat. Uh, GSP is coming up now. Not sure what's going on. Looks like all of them are rolling heavy towards Delta. Possibly. Or the Fox Trot, I'm not really sure. Here we go. GSP rolling hard on Charlie. Eh, uh, looks like Obey is going to get taken here pretty quickly. Moving over to Juice Layer again. And Obey with the 2-cap. GSP with the 2-cap. Echo is still in limbo. Echo goes to GSP. I touch my dingus with a kill on Orange Boot is. Moving to GSP, Mr. Payne gets a kill on Fat Cat. And GSP starting to neutralize what looks like Alpha. Ooh, nice kill there by Mr. Payne. I don't know how he got that shot. And Mr. Payne goes down. Looks like Thick Shady returns the favor. Orange Boot is with a kill on Unbeaten God. Moving over to Red Eye Reprisal. That's interesting. Actually, I think of what is this? A JDT is usually in the Attacula. They might have got a new pilot. Oh, Burman taking fire. And it looks like Bravo Cap goes GSP. Obey 368, GSP 375 in the first round. And Cack, any luck there? Bill 2 of 2. Committed. Running around Charlie. Ooh, Obey's actually got a three cap right now. See if they can hold on to Alpha. Or get Bravo. Looks like they're going for Bravo. Probably gonna lose Alpha. And Charlie also going. I expect this will be a very good match. Go check out here, Dissected Soul. Bay and GSP still neck and neck. Go check out Overdose from GSP. He sounds like you know somebody's lurking around. Oh, gets taken out. Looks like Juice Layer with the kill. Kriegenator. What the heck is Kriegenator doing? Hanging out at deployment. 
probably waiting for some armor. Guess. Moving, staying galaxy. Oh, obey with a four cap. That's gonna hurt. Can obey dethrone GSP. We're gonna find out. And obey quickly taking the lead. 336 GSP 301. Fat cat firing off some rounds. Go to top you on Charlie. Looks like Bay is pushing hard towards Alpha Bravo. Or GSP. Bay's gonna stop him. Yep. Looks like they burnt down the GSP guys moving up from Charlie. Let's see here. Moving over to Thick Shady. Watching some parachuters coming in. Doesn't get the kill. There he goes. Takes out risky business. And Obey still holding the four cap. Looking good for Obey right now. GSP now down almost 100 tickets. I don't think I've ever seen that. Nope. Jack, if you're watching the stream, feel free to pipe in. We got <laughs> Obey going crazy in chat over here. The hype is real right now. <laughs> what is going to happen? Obey holding hard on to all four flags. GSP only holding Charlie. And Alpha's flashing. But Obey has got... Looks like they got GSP in a chokehold right now. So, yeah, yep, yeah, yep. Yeah. Thick Shady... Gets taken out by overdose. Could could we actually see a win by Obey in this in this game? That'll uh, that'll put them as the uh, in my opinion the top team in hardcore. Um, otherwise, GSP. And here we go. JDT firing some rounds off. Gets a disable. And now GSP dropping down to 180 tickets. Obey still, still with the four cap. Yeah, that's gonna be hard to beat next round. Yeah, it's gonna be really hard to beat. This is this first game. Uh, obviously, they're playing uh, best of. You know, they're playing both sides of the map. Top, top tickets wins. Um, this first map here, Goldmud Railway, is looking very, very promising overall for Obey. I just don't see. When you have a 300 and some, you know, probably realistically about a 300 ticket win on this map by Obey, it's looking like right now. <clears throat> I just don't see any team topping that in the next round. So this map, Goldmud Railway, I'm I'm predicting is going to Obey easily. They're doing a good job keeping them for objectives yep. with only 16 people. Yeah, for sure. And going to Lou Digital up in the jet. Looks like he's trying to get a beat on... Oh, I thought he was going for that artillery. I guess that's, that probably is Obey's. And looks like Lou Digital coming around, trying to get the lock on Kriegenator. Shot off. Looks like he misses, barely clears the buildings. GSP 127, Obey 308. And nice loop there. Looks like Lou's going for the shot. Artillery vehicle's down. Obey holding heavily on to Alpha Bravo and Charlie, it looks. And looks like the objectives changed up a little bit. Let's see what GSP can do. At least bleed those tickets down. I think best case, they're going to pull the tickets down, you know, to within striking distance and come back to win it. That's the best they can hope for at this point. Look at like Lou is spinning here. I don't know if he's got a jet. Oh, there he goes. Okay. There we go. We got some dog fighting going on. See if we can get off, get the camera off. There we go. 
See some jets going out of here. Who is the uh, other jet up right now? Looks like Cola Sierra. See them both spinning here. Look at that. <laughs> it's interesting to watch, watching them spin on each other. Alright, getting back to the action. Bur oh, here we go. Uh, no. We're going to get something shot out for the Lee Digital. And it looks like 287 for Obey. I guess a little bit off. I was predicting 300, but it looks like GSP is actually pulling it back together. Just 63 tickets left for GSP. Fat Cat, where's he headed? He jumps out. Looks like they're going for Alpha. Ooh! Drops Mr. Payne. Update. I'm position one of two now. Haha, <laughs> one of two. Ooh! Oh. Fat Cat gets laid out. Looks like by smoking noobs. Jay Whiff. Good infantry player for Obey. Around an alpha. Uh, starting to get there. We go. Obey is starting to get an alpha cap. Uh, Steve, to win, you play the map both sides, and you have to have the higher ticket count unless you win both sides. If Obey wins this one with say 250 tickets, then GSP would have to win the next one by more than 250 to win the whole the map all together. Yep, that is correct. And I don't think they're doing burn rounds in between. Nice kill there by Thick Shady on Shane M15. And 15 tickets left. Obey once again with the four cap. We're gonna finish this out pretty dang strong against GSP in the first round of the first map of the semifinals of the Hardcore Cup. And there it is. 272 Obey 0 GSP. Surprisingly strong finish there. I didn't think it was gonna be. I did not think it was going to be that uh, big of a difference. Wow. What do you have in mind? Yeah, I can change it to whatever. Oh, oh I don't know. Oh, it yeah. It just says... Yep, yep. <laughs> One. Two. Say CAC rules all. What was the final on that one? Was the 272. Final? <laughs> What's up, Tuna? All right, guys, and whoa, that's an interesting camera. All right, somehow we are upside down. All right, we'll, uh, fix that. I guess that was different. All right, and here we go on the blue team. Are you? We have GSP, and now red team China. Obey. Let's see if Obey can uh, take it to him this side of the map and find out what happens. Oh! Touch my dingus gets taken out and see what... Crash into something, apparently? They take the soul with a little bit of uh, difficulty here in the Jeep. And it looks like GSP is actually gonna... Oh yeah. They're definitely moving strong on Alpha Bravo. Yeah, they're okay. Looks like a G GSP is picking it up here against Obey. Yeah. 
I got Obey rolling out. It's not looking good for them, though. Over at Bravo. We'll find out what happens here in a second. JSP with a kill. Got one Obey guy on the roof. Let's see if it looks like Fat Cat. And he gets taken down. Looks like GSP is going to have Alpha Bravo easily. And Charlie. Ooh. Way off to uh, not as good of a start as they were last time, that's for sure. And touch my dingus just running around here. Go to Kriegenator, Kriegenator. Oh, it looks like they are going to put some anti loo digitals up in the air. Here he goes for the shot. Lines it up. See what happens. And getting the lock. Yep. Waiting for the relock. And gets a shot off. It's going to be a solid hit. And he's drawn up on the chopper. Nice quick turn there. Fires it off. Let's see here. Going to red eye. There's the hit. You get to watch it from that angle. And he goes down. The digital rolling in. I think he's looking for Krieger. And a three cap obey. Looks like obey took a l second to get on their feet, but doing all right. They have the majority of the flags. Just gotta catch the tickets back up. So the score to beat what was it? Two fifty six. Two seventy. Two seventy two. Seventy two. Seventy two. Change that message there with the scrolling text to say. Score for GSP to beat two two seventy two. Looking for it, Rizzle. There we go. And looks like Obey once again trying to go for that four cap. Going for Alpha dissected still on the roof. And here they go. And it looks like they're probably gonna get it. And they're also going for the Charlie cap. Are they gonna go for a full five cap this time? Might happen. Not likely. Usually it's pretty hard to get the last cap. And now Obey is starting to lose Bravo, but they got the four cap. And Obey now takes the lead. 336 to 321. They go, Rizzle. Yep, GSP is going to have to do a whole lot better on this round if they're going to beat 272. And Obey is going to, here they go, they're going for the Alpha Cap now. Can't lose uh, pretty quick here, they're going to be too low to even be able to win it. Once the uh, score there on the blue team hits 272, or actually anything below 273, yeah, 272 or lower, um, done and obey will take round one moving to thick shady on their rpg firing at little bam bam gets the kill so bam bam and burman sod go down and 10 tickets away and obey will secure round one or map one Red Eye Reprisal here. Let's go check him out. Where's he at? Squatty reason. Oh, let's go to Casper. Oh, Casper's in a tank. I don't think he typically takes the tanks. Say no more one. They're below 272. Um, looks like Obey has just secured 
that one for a win. Yep. This is a uh, kind of different. First time I actually got to really interact with the chat as much as I. <laughs> Am I a teacher? <laughs> uh, no. I wanted to be a history teacher, but I hate college, so no, I'm not a teacher. Heiser? I I don't know, man. <laughs> I was talking to Heiser the other day, Ender. I've known him for like six months, and we have yet to play Battlefield together. Well, it requires you guys playing more than a half hour a week each. That's true, Statistically, too. not very possible. <laughs> Alright, we're just watching the tickets burn here. Casper doing work. Let's go watch some GSP. What do we got here? Let's go check out. We haven't watched much yet. It's Copenhagen 44. Looks like he's on foot over at Echo. Throws that magnifier on. And the flag has stopped. Kicks the magnifier off. He's lurking in the corner. Spots out of tank. Like JDT rolling around the side. Let's go watch JDT's point of view. And he, oh, he draws up, but he misses. Oh, and looks like JDT just totally annihilates Copenhagen there. Exactly where he was sitting. Uh, Rizzle. Are you still there? You seem to know who picked what maps. This is our first broadcast for this tournament. Do you know who picked what maps on this? Yeah, um, I actually, I do know because uh, I heard JDT and Krieger talking about it. I think it was on our page. Um, Obey picked, picked this one. And then um, GSP knew that Obey didn't like Rogue or whatever, so they, they chose that one for them. Are you freaking kidding me? What happened? I think I just realized something and I'm texting him right now. <laughs> With the hashtag? Yes. <laughs> <laughs> That's what I was thinking. <laughs> I don't think it is. Is it? You don't think it is? The crew cruising the house. The crew? Yep. Steven the cat rolling the tank here. 143, 142, 140, GSP, 252, Obey. In. The second side of map one, um, as we discussed, if you guys are just tuning in, uh, Obey has officially secured map number one as a win. No, Rizzle, they, he was saying that uh, GSP picked Rogue because he, they knew Obey didn't like that map. There's Count. Looks like a little more of a fight here, obviously. Uh, they're bleeding no base tickets down a little bit more in this round. Not a lot, though. Boom. Heiser, Ender, he doesn't know what you're talking about. Mm. I don't know who Madden is. He makes uh, <laughs> video games. <laughs> yeah, he works for EA. <laughs> yeah. Madden, I've never heard of her. And moving to Cola Sierra. I think he's kind of floating in. Does he, have a, he does. He has a Coca Cola emblem on his jet. All right. Apparently, it's the. Uh, there you go. Official advertisements. We'll start putting them on fighter jets for beverage companies. Budweiser. <laughs> Breakfast of F 18 pilots.
Red Bull, there you go, because it gives you wings, right? Put them on jets. Yeah. Oh, it's not a German oh. jet. Not bad, Rizzle. Imagine pro, yeah. Ooh, obey. Looks like with a four cap. Apparently, GSP went into round two, really wanting to break up the Alpha Bravo thing. It looked like obey held it. I say obey. GSP went in there trying to break up obey's Alpha Bravo caps. It looks like they've done that here in the second round. Obey. It seemed like they held on to Alpha Bravo. I think 100% of the time last last round from what I remember. Obey going for the five cap now on Alpha. Not good, not good, but I don't think they're going to get it. Looks like a lot of Obey converging and GSP on Alpha. And 13 tickets left. Map number one. And Obey looks like they're still going to finish with over a 200 ticket lead. Very, very strong finish by Obey. Looking good for them here in the semifinals. And that's game 208 Obey 0 for GSP. Be right back. Somebody's calling me. Yeah, I gotta talk to you. Alright. So, what do you guys think? Uh, I think is round number two going to be Rogue Transmission? I think it is. What do you guys think? I think GSP will be able to. Yeah, we'll pull it back. That was a pretty strong finish right there. Very strong. Obey us. Coming from the chat. Yeah, that was uh, kind of seemed like it was a little off for for a GSP and crew in the house repping Eternal Nemesis. Thank you, there, crew. I'll be back in two seconds while this loads, guys. Just a minute. All right, guys, I was filling little parts. Now I'm back. Once again, guys, um, if you didn't know, we have a tournament coming up. It is starting next weekend. Next, this Actually, it's coming Friday, April 3rd, is the Danger Close Tournament. 16 v. 16, Conquest Small. And up here, we have Obey, Blue Team, RU, DSP, Red Team, China. Map number two, semifinals, Hardcore Cup. Here we go. Anyways, like I was saying, guys, um, our tournament starts Friday. It will be 16 teams. 16 teams. 31 games total. And uh, double elimination, similar to how this will be played. Um, every match we broadcast right here. So if you guys haven't punched the follow button, don't forget to do that. Um, we obviously, we obviously uh, stream other stuff on here. I'll, I use this for my own personal streaming as well. But, we're here, you can tune in when you want, and don't when you don't want to. <laughs> Thanks, Mama Bro. I, uh, I thought you were somebody else because of the whole hashtag Destiny's Dead. <laughs> Apparently so that's something that's I known. had to, I had to ask him, which is my brother-in-law actually, so I called him, and he said <laughs> no. So... <laughs> <laughs> uh, uh, now it's looking totally polar opposite here. GSP with a three cap. Obey holding on to one flag. What are they doing here? Go to the top tabletop view. It looks like. Let's see here if I can get to a different camera. Here we go. Ah, falling apart here. There we go. Wait, wait, wait. Let's go to the camera. Let's 
Watch. Looks like Obey rolling hard on Charlie right now. The hillside not really occupied. A couple GSP guys. Or uh, Obey, I guess it is. No, I don't know if... They're just slugging each other back and forth. GSP pouring on Charlie. Obey it pouring into Charlie. Oh, getting backwards again. <laughs> Lack of sleep and teams keep flip-flopping sides. You think I'd have this down by now? Okay, I'm confused now. I will find out who you are, Mama Bear. Because I did not say DB, and then you just said DB. <laughs> Hey, crazed. crazed. And we are two and two right now. Alpha Charlie Obey, Bravo Delta GSP, Cola Sierra, the Stained Galaxy. Still hanging at Charlie. Last Man Squad probably trying to lay low. He gets a spawn off. Nice kill on J Whiff by Stained Galaxy. Looks like GSP trying to get Charlie back. Looks like Sting Galaxy goes down, gets dropped by Fat Cat. Confused. I'm confused too. <laughs> oh, 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 this is ugly. Obey with a four cap. And Delta starting to go. Let's see if we can see who was over at Delta. Looks like Griffman 12 gets dropped, taken out by Shane M15. Lou Digital. Got gone here. Chopper's going to spin. That thing's toast. Oh, Lou didn't die. Wow. Yeah, I just look up at the. Flags and all of a sudden, Obey's got a four cap. Looks like Delta's still contested, but Obey with a three cap. I'm gonna catch this game back up now, possibly. 312 GSP, 305 Obey. Uh, crazed? Um,. You just missed the first map. Uh, I think, what was it? Two, what was it? Two sacky? I keep forgetting. 270 something? 270. 272. 272 for Obey. Second round was like 208 Obey. So they won both on Golma. This is uh, more theoretically supposed to be GSP's map, but um, looks like now Obey in the lead here. 302 with a 3 cap. 284 GSP. So you missed. Crazy, you missed one map and uh, two rounds. Or two rounds, I should say. And it looks like Colasierra getting... Oh, it looks like he's trying to get some hits on a phase. Is that Lou Digital? Must be Lou. Oh, and they go into a spin here. You guys want to watch some spinning action here between the Jets? Of course, I'm out of... What happens if I let the timer go down? Return to the combat area. You think it'll kill my spectator spot? Kick me out? Probably. <laughs> Which would put me right into the spectator spot. <laughs> <laughs> Let's do a quick host. It worked. Obey Voshinova. Looks like we got a couple flags flashing. Bravo and Delta. Moving to GSP's overdose. Moving up to Alpha. Rocking that sniper. Isn't he like the number one sniper in the US or something like that? Or I don't remember what it was. Something crazy like that. Yeah, B Rizzles, that's that's what I meant if that's not how I said it. But yeah, that's that's the way I understood it is I think 
Rieger's exact words were, uh, we figured there's something that Obey saw on here that they didn't like. So that's why they picked it from, uh, I think that's almost a direct quote. From what I understand, anyways, Unbeaten God. Ooh, let's get some Unbeaten God versus Overdose. Sniper action. See how that goes down. 282 obeying the lead, 219 GSP, map number two, round number one. Oh, goes for the C4, unbeaten god, gets laid down though by a 416. Voshinova here tossing M2s down a little hole. Right. It puts the M2 in the hole. Voshinova reverse repairing. Orange Buddhas. GSP rolling on down. Hey, his uh, optics are about the same guy. Ooh, gets taken down by Unbeaten God with the gold magnum. Looks like three flags flashing. The only flag held right now is by GSP. Steven the Cat. Looks like he's going for that Viper. And drops Burman Sod along the way. And Viper goes down. Another kill on Stain Galaxy. Going for a third. Gets a kill assist. You let it rizzle. And we are two and two, everything kind of at a standstill. Oh, looks like Alpha Bravo gone. You know, I have to laugh. Speaking of the lotion on the skin thing, <laughs> there was a post earlier on, uh, if you guys didn't see it on the official Battlefield uh, Facebook page, said something about uh, which, in regards to Hardline, which is the most destructive level lotion, is what they wrote. They put level lotion. <laughs> and. Uh, I was reading through the comments just looking for it, and of course somebody with 45 likes said something about it, it puts the level, or rubs the level ocean on its skin. <laughs> Made me laugh. Uh, the level ocean. I'd be embarrassed. You have a page with millions of people on it, or however many they have, and... Right, level ocean? And looks like GSP with a three cap now. Going for the four cap. This is going to turn out to be a pretty good game. Think we'll get to the tiebreaker? Which what is, is the tiebreaker? Um. Level ocean, <laughs> yeah. Uh. It is. What did I say it was? It is. Here, let me look. Parasol? Like Parasol. And three flags flashing. Both teams still neck and neck. Um, GSP slightly behind, but not by much. Looks like about, you know, give or take 20 tickets. Um, looks like they're going to catch it up here, though, in just a second. <coughs> Obey's tickets up there starting to drop. Looks like a red eye. In here watching all three flags flashing. Let's see if we can find Shady, what's he got? Yeah, you can cap from the top of the radar dome, huh? I didn't know that. Oh, he gets taken out. Looks like Broken Devil Dog, ACWR. Alright, chat. One more time. Who's gonna win it? Type it out there, let me know. Where's your bet at? Mm, 
both still neck and neck. 161 Obey, 152 GSP. Fleet Fox, GSP, $500. Old statement there. <laughs> we got Craze Killer Obey. Attorney coming up as well. They're solid. Heiser says Obey. So we've got two Obeys, one GSP. Dissected with a nice double kill. Stained Galaxy, Mr. Payne. And knife's a beacon. Maybe he's taking fire. Just looks like four. Four take a difference. 151 obey, 144 GSP. Ooh. Nice kill assist by dissected soul. GSP rolling a little bit of a bite on Alpha. On Delta Bravo pretty hard as you guys can see from the tabletop view. Looks like Bravo is gonna go to GSP as they have no contest for there. can do. Take a heavy fire. Boshinova. Both teams, two and two for flag cap, still neck and neck. 138 obey with a slight lead over GSP at Looks like Obey still. Slight lead here. 131. GSP 1. 1 1. 1 1 1. 1 1. Hungry and homeless. Alright. Let's go watch him for a minute. What's he rocking? That looks like. Oh. Shot in the side of the head by Thick Shady. Bam Bam 2 1 3. Hagen 44. See what's going to happen. Either way, uh, I think at this point this is a pretty low ticket count overall. One twenty two. And, uh, Dvartic, I hear that you guys, what is it, PHVT and Isla? You guys have a match here in just a little bit as well, right? 10v10 domination. Like 121 obey, 90 for GSP. Let's go to the top here. Looks like obey going for Delta. Or, I'm sorry, Charlie. <laughs> this is Delta on Conquest Large. Charlie. Oh, yeah, it right. took a while for me to get used to when we first started playing Conquest. I know. Oh, that's right, yeah. Crazed, it looks like ESSD, and I guess it's MOD, right? And CLNR tonight. Very nice. And we have the uh, PHVT and Isla, so we've got a couple other matches. Uh, obviously not, as far as I know, not really being broadcasted, um, at least by us, but a couple other competitive matches going on tonight. Everybody getting warmed up for that tournament, April 3rd, next Friday. This coming Friday. And now GSP with a three cap, but losing Charlie. Even a broken devil dog and his crew rolling into Charlie. 
Mm, okay. I was going to say I'm not sure what he's shooting at. Then I saw it. Still about a 20 ticket lead by Obey. Freeganator. Dragging off rounds. Devil Dog, leaving deployment with a four-wheeler. Where is Delta going? Delta starting to go to obey, slowly. Yeah, it's not really going anywhere. Charlie's starting to go. I think I saw in the background, he went for the Jihad Jeep. Oh, who was that? Casper? Yeah, I think it was Casper trying to go for the Jihad. Looks like Burman and little Bam Bam. Got lucky on that one. I don't know if anyone else was paying attention in the background, but I barely missed him with that Jihad four-wheeler, I guess you would call it. 81, Obey, 47 GSP, coming down to the wire. Delta is still up in the air. Charlie, I think Delta, now the ticket should start falling pretty quick. Probably to a win for Obey. Three straight wins so far in this matchup. If they can hold these, they should. That's just mapped pretty quickly. It's kind of stalling here in the last hundred tickets for sure. Bay rused them, saying, yeah, we don't like this map, or <laughs> kind of hinted at it, just so they wouldn't play it. <laughs> and 12 tickets left for GSP. Ooh, but they got the three caps. They can just hold on to these. They got to really be careful, though. They can't really spawn much more. I guess, once again, just bleed those tickets down best they can. Nice cold kill by Cola Sierra. Six tickets left. Oh, Cola Sierra goes down. Gets taken out by Lee Digital. Really not much to have to win by, though. It'd be interesting to see if uh, it's kind of tipped one way or the other in the next round. Overdose gets dropped. Getting down the last few tickets for GSP. It's going to be three wins. Let's see what the score to beat is going to be. Smoking noobs with a kill. Put in revive, it looks like. And GSP doing a nice job holding on their last few tickets, and there it is, 42-0. 42, it's a pretty good one to beat. Yeah. Not going to be hard to do, really. We really wish somebody would back out. Still number one. Yep. Once again, thank you for that, CAC. Appreciated. Well, not a problem, man. They see your stuff. I could, I could stay in there and kind of explain it to them what's going on. <laughs> we could watch. We could imagine it. I could draw on a uh, paint. I could pull up paint. We could draw, and you could just paint us a picture, <laughs> like some Bob Ross, while we're in the queue. Uh. By now, you would have been in here if you were queue number one. You would have gotten here about in between the Gold Mud Railway matches. Oh, yeah, maybe. And here we go. And flip flop teams blue team, Russia, GSP, red team. China obey. 
So if Obey can win this, they are done, I think, and they're moving up. Obey just needs to either win the round or keep GSP from winning by more than 42. Um, should that occur, should uh, GSP win this round, they will be going in round number three, and I believe it to be Parazel Storm, unless that's changed. What do you guys think? It's looking awfully like, awfully... In favor, I should, in favor of G of uh, Obey winning, and I cannot talk, man. Only like four hours of sleep. Definitely looks like Obey is gonna probably take this. I don't know. Anything could happen. We've seen, especially with Obey, we've seen some crazy stuff. Uh, for the last boat, I guess both tournaments we did before. Was that the 1-0 win against um, actually Masticators that end up winning, wasn't it? in the Clash of the Clans tournament on Shanghai? Uh, yes. That's uh, right. two ticket. No, it was one ticket. Yeah, and moving over to Burman Sod. Man Sod. Reganator. Hang out at Charlie. Try to shoot some Obey out of the sky. Alpha Delta belonging to Obey, Bravo now belongs to Obey, and Charlie only for GSP. Can Obey do it? Can they take GSP? We're probably about 10 to 15 minutes away from finding out. At least if GSP is still going to hang in here and take it to the tiebreaker. Looks like Boshinova getting hammered right now. Our GSP's Hilo. Looking for another shape. Oh, he takes him out. Looks like Stained Galaxy. Let's go see some more Stained Stain Galaxy and Kriegenator. 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 The so message him on Facebook and try to distract him. Uh -huh. Score uh, 42 tickets there, Erwin. 42-0 uh, was the score last round. 42 obey, 0 GSP. It's like Krieger moving over to the TV guided. Area pop one off. Oh, we should have fired there. So he's looking for something else. Staying guys, it's like they're kind of just hovering right, going in for a straight front. Here we go. It's a kill, drops fat cat. A couple more off. I'm not sure what he's shooting at there. I'll watch him light up alpha here. Nice free cam view on it. Oh, he gets shot down. Dissected soul. Or no, I guess Griffman. Looking at the wrong part of the kill feed. Nice kill there by Griffman in the jet. Looks like we're still just three ticket difference. 350 GSP, 345 for Obey. All four flags up in the air. Orange Buddha and Obey uh, Juice Slayer. Ooh, gets taken out. Orange Buddha drops him. And lots of fire going down. 
He's feeding the cat. How he hasn't died. There he goes. Shane M15 with the kill on Steven. And a three cap GSP, but Bravo's flashing. GSP has got to catch a second wind here, and like I said, beat, beat Obey by 42 is not going to be super difficult. Not a huge ticket count, but still got to make it happen, go into the tiebreaker. Go to that tabletop view that Fox reminded me of a while back. I completely forgot about it. Let's see how teams are moving right now. Looks like we have a few spawn beacons up over uh, from Obey at Alpha. Uh, yeah, see, there's there's a good example of what I always knew. Obey with their spawn beacons. I've got one, two, three, four, five, six. Yep, six of them right there on the map. To about two of GSPs. Moving a fat cat. We're at Charlie. Gets a kill on Stain Galaxy. Oh, pick him out. Bam bam on the T90. Moving a broken devil dog. GSP. Again, only a six ticket difference, but it looks like Obey has once again taken the lead. The three cap, but looks like they're losing Charlie, possibly getting Alpha. Orange Buddha gets dropped by Red Eye. Mr. Payne. I'm hanging out down below here underneath the satellite dish. And three cap for Obey. And they're holding on to Bravo, starting to lose it, but they got it. Obey has just got to play this one last round strong, and it looks like they will be moving up. Be a huge, uh, huge feat for Obey. I know that uh, they're going to be excited if that's what happens here. Go check out Red Eye over here. Ooh, shoots Kriegenator right off the four-wheeler. Red Eye with a kill assist. Probably Stained Galaxy. Ooh, nice double kill on Shane and who's the other one? Recon Sniper. Obey once again, three cap. 224. 420 for GSP and another kill by Red Eye. He's going to town over there. Lou Digital drops risky business. And Lou Digital gets dropped by Kriegenator. And here's committed from Obey. Obey holding strong right now under those flags. Um, about ready to secure a 100 ticket lead. Looks like Obey is probably going to be moving up to the finals. Um, looks like they are going to dethrone GSP. That is my prediction. Looking pretty dang good for Obey. They definitely look good tonight. What do you think, Kek? Yep, pretty good for him right now. I know they are going to be ecstatic. Yep. Committed. Don't want to be in their chat. <laughs> it's actually surprising. They've come a long way since we started playing them about before first came out. Yeah. Yeah, for sure. 
I've noticed uh, since we took our break there um, from playing, got back and started playing with and against Obey, they've really stepped it up. They weren't bad by any means before, but I noticed a, a big improvement. And that's why I said if anybody can do it, it's going to be Obey. 168. It's like for GSP, 273 Obey. Yep, yep, looking good. Looking good for Obey. I, uh... I just found out who the other people in Spectator Spot were. Hmm? Other people streaming this match as well. Who's that? JDT, sure. There's some J. Third eyes. Oh, that's yeah. You guys, more than welcome to go check out that stream. <laughs> that's all I'm gonna uh, say. <laughs> yeah. One twenty-five GSP two fifty-six obey. Not looking good for GSP. Nice TV there by JD. Kill on Burman. Looks like he hopped out to get a repair and didn't happen. Going to town over there. But there's only assist. 106 for GSP. JD going to town. Krieg Interstate Galaxy get dropped by JD. Oh, Erman! I wish I could have seen that. Nice kill with the tank. Determined to get the server full. Shooting you wants to get. Looks like CY6 wanting to get the tier one server going right after this. You guys are more than welcome. We have it set for the conquest large version of the Danger Close maps. Um, they're all in the correct order that uh, that they will appear on the tournament list. Looks like. Yep. It looks like Obey is going to take this one. I don't see it turning around for GSP. Obey in prime form tonight. Looks like they are. Uh, you're gonna go ahead and advance with a win over GSP. Amazing work. Definitely, definitely a awesome, awesome performance. They brought their A game. No one can argue that. Um, a note about the tier one server. It is every map, not just the first three. Yes, every it's, map. Mm, no. Yep, just 54 tickets remaining. Yeah, there, this is this game is going to obey. Um, guys, I'm waiting to confirm if you want to hang out for just a couple minutes. I think if we can get a hold of JDT, obviously he's a little bit busy right now. 
Uh, no, he's not. He's actually dead. But um, he's probably pretty busy in the match. <laughs> but uh, we're going to try to get a post-game interview real quick. What we'll do is we'll get a party chat going. Cack will send me an invite. Uh, make a private party and get JDT in there. And Cack will ask me a few questions. And you guys can go ahead and hang out for a few more minutes. We'll, uh, we'll find out here in just a minute. Let's see... And five tickets left. Obey's going to crush GSP with over 200 tickets. It looks like most likely one ticket left. And that's going to be game right there. Zero. GSP, 202 for Obey. And that is it. I believe we are done here. Uh, we will confirm this in just a minute. Yep, that is it. All right, guys, stick around for a minute, and we'll see if we can't get that post-game interview to get JDT in here real quick. Mr. Cack will interview him. Um, guys, thanks for watching. If you need to get going, we'll catch you later. It looks like everybody's wanting to get rolling on our server right now, um, the Tier 1 Gaming Live server. But, again, I'm under Tier 1 Gaming Live. Each one of is playing Hardcore Battlefield. And Mr. Cack is busy at the moment. Okay, and I think we got confirmation here. If you guys want to hang out for just one moment, got a lot of obey out in the chat. Um, we'll get JDT in here. So, uh, Kak, you'll just have to. You got everything. Do you have to move your headset over? Oh uh, no, I have a different headset for computer and position. Oh, good deal. Okay, um, if you want to go ahead and invite JDT and I and close party chat, and I will just listen in as you ask him. And we'll capture it all. Okay. All right. All right. Not going anywhere. Just hang out. We'll go over to. Where is it at? There we go. User disconnected from your channel. All right, and here we go, guys. We're going to listen in. All right, got to mess with my settings here real quick. Uh, let's see if we can get him on here. may not be able to. Yeah, I can't hear anything either. Hold on a sec, guys. Let's see if we can... I'm not sure why it doesn't.
might be able to do that. All right, guys, I think we got it here. All right, guys, Mr. Cack here with JDT 2012 of Obey Us. Uh, first of all, JDT, very, very nice job. Did not Thank see you. that it, coming. Cack. Um, you pretty much rolled everything besides one pretty close match. Uh, what's your overall feel of how that went? I think it went well, obviously. Um, but I we went into it thinking that we had two extremely good teams, good discipline teams, and um, we, as long as we stuck to our game plan and executed what we needed to execute, we were pretty confident that we had a good shot at a uh, at GSP. Um, they're traditionally they're known for being one of the top hardcore teams um, for a while now. You know, this is our second time playing them. The first time they stomped us, so we knew we were going to have our hands full, and we, we made sure that we were ready for them. All right. Uh, next question. We we heard that GSP picked Rogue Transmission because they might have seen something that y'all didn't like, or was that just a ruse, or did y'all seriously not want to play that map? Well, they last week in the tournament they played B Bag, and they played Rogue Transmission and Gold Mud, and. We saw a couple of things that appealed to us on Gold Mud, so we chose Gold Mud. And it, there was nothing else besides that, and it's a better map, in my opinion, than Rogue. And I think I think Krieger had the impression, God bless him, um, that we chose Gold Mud because we didn't want to play Rogue. Um, <laughs> nobody really wants to play Rogue, but there was, there was nothing else to it. Um, besides that, but I, I think that we had fun on both maps. Um, GSP is, they were a royal pain in the rear, especially on one of those rounds on, on a rogue transmission. So, um, I was upset that he picked it only because I think it's an awful map. <laughs> <laughs> All right. That's, uh, understandable. No, made people who do like that map. No. Um, after after y'all confirmed that y'all had the overall win, what was the reaction if the, if there was any from your squad or your team? If you were on a different chat yeah. or anything, we had a, I mean, we had eight guys in our party, and because we we knew this was going to be a tough match, um, we went into it assuming that we were probably going to have to go to a tiebreaker. And Paracel Storm is a complete mess. So <laughs> we went into it thinking, okay, it's going to be a close game. And I don't think anybody breathed during that whole match. So when it was <laughs> finally over, there was like a collective sigh, and everybody just kind of sat there in silence. And it was like, is it done? Like, <laughs> do we have to play Parasol now? So it yeah. was uh, it was really a collective side, you know, side relief, and um, I think our guys are pretty stoked about it. But um, GSP is a great team. I wouldn't be surprised if I get inboxed here within the next couple of weeks asking for another round. And yeah, as long as it accommodates scheduling, we'd love to do it because that was a lot of fun. Uh -huh. Um, any ideas of who or who would you like to face in the championship round coming up? Um, well, I mean, I'd like. Does it even matter? I mean, <laughs> it 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 doesn't really matter to me. I would like another shot at bowl, um, simply because um, I think they got the better the better of us the first time we played them. Um, right. But I would also really enjoy playing GSP again because. There's 16 guys on that team that think that we got the better of them. So um, either either way, it'll be a great match. 
I'm looking forward to it, and we'll see what plays out in the uh, in the Bull and GSP match here. I think that's next week. I'm not positive though. Right. Yeah, that would be a good match rematch for uh, GSP and y'all. Um, yeah. Is the championship maps the same? Are they all the same? No. The um, so they will each pick a map that they haven't used before. Um, so, like, we chose, for our first one, we chose Zavad, and then we chose um, Dawnbreaker, and now we just chose Golmud. So we couldn't use any of those three maps again, for example, when we go into this championship match. And that same rule applies to these guys. So uh, we might get to see might get to see him play Locker. I don't think that's been chosen. Um, I'm not sure what Bull's going to do. They might choose Golmud against them. So we'll see. All right. All right, one last question here. Obviously, your team's probably pretty stoked about making a championship. Now you just got to wait to see who you'll be facing. Um, going into the championship, going into the weeks preparing for it, how do you think y'all will prepare map-wise and strategy-wise? And I'm not we, trying to steal ideas. or anything. No. Um, as soon as we know what maps we're playing, I'll roll out the strategies. Um our squad leaders rarely change, so our squad leaders know primarily what their what their jobs are. Nice. Um, so usually in the weeks before, we'll have our guys that are going to be in armor. They need to spend extra time in armor. Um, whatever setups or loadouts that they're going to be using, they need to be practicing those loadouts. Um, for instance, if we were playing gold mud like we did, a lot of our tankers were running setups that they don't usually run because of what their tank's jobs were on Gold Mud. We didn't pull our tanks up to Alpha Bravo more than a couple times. So you don't really need to have an LMG or an HE or a heavy machine gun, for example. So it's a lot of practicing your setups for what maps you're playing, getting comfortable with it so you can execute your game plan. All right. Well, JDT, thank you for coming in this interview, and good luck to you and Obey. Hope you have hope for the best for you. Yeah, well, thank you. Thanks so much for broadcasting. I know it was a little bit of a nightmare. And <laughs> the scheduling all. caught everybody off guard. But um, we had a blast, and good. we hope you guys enjoyed watching. Yep. Guys, I am Keck with Tier 1. Uh, thanks for listening in. And that is the end of it, guys. Ta-da! All right, guys, um, on that note, we're shutting down. I will have some more news for you. If you guys haven't checked us out online yet, be sure to go to facebook.com slash t1gaminglive, or you can go to t1gaminglive.com. And lastly, I'm Ender with Tier 1 Gaming Live, Eternal Nemesis Clan, and Hardcore Battlefield. We will catch you guys on the next one. Obey GSP Hardcore Cup.